Dean, we're, th we're through to the next round of the cup after an interesting test for the lads. Yeah, tough test. Um, Hayes are flying this season. I know Paul personally, top manager, um, used to winning. And uh, they're very tricky nights, these nights. They can be mentally, but everything we want to get out of the game, we got over, so that's very important. We, we showed real resilience uh, throughout the first half. Sat Sam Granville obviously cleared one just off the line. Did, did you feel like that would have uh, changed the, the, the end, ro end result if that had that gone in? I thought we had our own chances ourselves, you know, so it was, it was a good cup toy, good local derby, good cup toy, entertaining. You know, you always want to win them. I know we're a couple of divisions higher than them, but Hayes are a strong side. In my opinion, they're a the top 10 National League South side uh, with the players they've got, especially the coach they've got as well. So, um, But I was proud of our players. We kept that winning mentality and uh, great for our supporters to win again. That's three on the bounce. And uh, it was, that's what I was. I was emphasising the players before the game, we've got to keep winning, keep that winning mentality and uh, it breeds confidence as well so it's good for Serhat to score, really good for Blooms to score and get the winner at the end so you know we played three up front today and uh, two of the lads have scored. Uh, as you mentioned there, Serhat was brought back into the team today and scored a really super goal didn't he? Yeah great finish, good press, we caught him on a press, uh, made them play square, fell straight into a trap and Serhat had a great first touch and buried it, you know. he's a good finisher Serhat. Um, and he, I thought he walked hard as well tonight. He's come off a little, a little bang in the ribs, so hopefully he's all right. And an, an, another highlight from tonight being Jamie Turley returning to the team. How pleased are you for him? Yeah, he's a skipper. He's a leader. Uh, he's a man of men. Tools is he's, one, he's an old schooler. Uh, so we're delighted to have him back. We'll see how he recovers tomorrow, and uh, hopefully be uh, available for selection for Saturday. But we're delighted to have him back. Uh, we've now won three on the bounce, as you've mentioned there. How, how important is it that we keep this, this winning run going now? Yeah, we want to keep winning football matches. That's what it's about. But, you know, everyone's smiling, everyone's buzzing. Our supporters go away happy, um, and it's very important in the cup that you just get into the next round. And it's a competition we want to go far in. You know, we want to try to win the competition. If I'm being totally honest with you, we have to create a winning mentality around the football club, a togetherness. You only do that by winning football matches. And to be fair, we're a very honest team. Went really hard today. Uh, it was good to have you know Greenwich got. A 90 minutes under his belt which he needed so did Beardy so everything we wanted out of the game happened Will de Havilland made his debut uh, sorry Ryan de Havilland uh, Will uh, Ryan de Havilland made his debut and he did really well um, so I'm pleased more minutes for uh, James Callan and uh, Sam Granville two, two youngsters what did you make of their performance tonight yeah he did really well yeah yeah Granville's got no lungs hasn't he he can run for days he's like a draw cell bunny he just keeps going and going so he's still got learning the game they're still young lads James very mature he's got really mature head on his shoulder so I thought he, was really, he did really well in goal so a um, bit disappointed to see the Peno again I think that's eight, our eighth Peno we've had against us this year we still haven't had one yet so hopefully that luck will turn for us sooner rather than later and we've got a few days now to prepare for, for wheels turn away on uh, on Saturday how much are you looking forward to that one personally? yeah looking forward to it you know we had a fantastic time there as manager we created a great bond I did personally with the supporters they were very good to me and uh, we rewarded them with a lot of success. So, and so were the players that played for me at that football club as well. Some fantastic players. A lot of them have gone on to do better things. Um, and playing in teams that are at the top of this division. So, yeah, really proud of my time there. I'm looking forward to going back. There is a lot of friends there. So, uh, we're looking forward to it. Thanks for your time this evening. Cheers.